Today, we're going to be taking a look at six of the most insane war reports that I've seen in the last couple of weeks, plus a couple of honorable mentions, and you guys are going to get some free stuff, so make sure you stick around. What's going on, guys? Cheers. Well, I'm all out of vodka. I'm kidding. Anyway, guys, before we jump in, if you guys wanted an update on my current KVK, pass eight opened last night around a little after reset, uh, and we are pushing into Kingsland at this point. Things are looking okay right now, uh, but we've got a couple of different fronts we're fighting on, so you you know we'll see. My Zenobia is just sitting in this fort over here, wishing a motherfucker would. Anyway, let's jump into the war reports because that's why you guys are here. And this first report we're gonna take a look at isn't even one of the top six most insane of this video. Okay, this is an honorable mention that I had to include just because of how insane this trade was so take a look at this report right here Alita is that is that the gentleman's name here I, I can't I don't know his name I'm so sorry if I mispronounced it uh they rallied against BT cyborg and there's got to be something going on here okay there's got to be something else this uh, this is obviously a player rally they're hitting this guy's city uh it is is it getting swarmed like what is going on here this is an absolutely insane trade we see 14.3 million from the rally and 75.3 million from the city absolute disgusting this is this is every rise of kings players dream trade right here 2 million dead to 7.3 million dead absolutely insanity luckily enough we also have the troop buffs here all of the commanders in this picture are fully expertise which is crazy considering the trade um we see some really solid cavalry attack and health here absolutely love everything about this rally this guy uh, man rest in peace and these support skills aren't even max so maybe that's what it was the second and final honorable mention of this video comes in the form of a fort rally by our boy over here i7 wolf hitting Raija so in the fort with the Zenobia Isun Sin and this is a beautiful Pakal Herald rally and guys spoiler alert you are going to see I think almost every other report in this video is Pakal it is officially Pakal season baby y'all are sleeping on Pakal Herald these rallies are absolutely devastating and I love it now again I don't know what happened here if this Zenobia YSS got swarmed or what the deal was but man we see three million dead to nine million dead a three to one trade plus three million sev wounds absolutely crazy again I have no idea what happened here maybe the tech was off may I, I I really don't know I don't know anything about this report other than the fact that my god this is an ROK players dream to get trades like this baby oh it makes me feel so good this is why people play the game boys this is why you want to see these massive massive trades and I absolutely love it now before we jump into the top six I told you guys that I was going to give away some free stuff in this video so what well, come a little closer here come a little closer I'm going to give a hundred dollars to one of you lucky subscribers who comments down below seriously no strings attached I'm sure many of you have already commented so you are you're already entered you're already good to go in like a week I'll just pin the winner and I'll try to respond to you over there or maybe I'll try to find you on my discord but that's not all guys I am super excited to finally announce my official partnership with gamer subs now you guys know if you've watched any of my videos that I'm always drinking soda energy drinks coffee and their energy supplement GG is actually a really cool blend of organic caffeine antioxidants and nootropics and to celebrate the beginning of this official partnership they wanted to give you guys some free stuff too you can try GG absolutely for free there's a link in the description use code Omni and they've agreed to give away a bunch of free samples to our community here on YouTube for a limited time you don't pay for the product you don't pay for the shipping you also don't even have to put in your card information like it's it's literally free Free. and it's international for all of you guys who watch my channel that aren't from the US and not only are they doing that limited giveaway for free product but you guys if you use code Omni you're gonna save 10% and to celebrate the official partnership you'll get free shipping for the next few days if you guys place an order whether it's just some free sample packets or if you buy some waifu candy whatever tub you want send me a screenshot anywhere on discord on Instagram on Twitter it doesn't matter if you send me a screenshot of your order I will give away another $100 to to somebody who places an order so there you go two ways that you can win a hundred dollars absolutely for free oh and I also should mention um they've got some cool shirts uh it th my favorite thing about this shirt is the um the the material is just like so soft like it's just such a nice it's like a really it's just like a really soft shirt and that's my that's the only really thing I like about it pretty much uh anyway let's get back into the video cheers starting off with number six we have none other than light versus inf this is 
my god pakal harold what are you doing this is actually insane pakal harold hits the pass okay we have 9.4 million dead for the rally with 9.2 million severely wounded we have 128,000 slightly wounded units hitting this zenobia yss who has 11.9 million dead units and 11.2 million severely wounded with 156 million slightly wounded units guys i told you you're sleeping on Pakal Herald. I, I think you are, okay? Now, we got to see how they go against uh, Amanatore and, and Artemisia, right? But seriously, this is definitely the best rally you can have with infantry. It's absolutely insane. This trade goes and proves it that you can go positive against Zenobia YSS with infantry. My God, JWM absolute savages since day one. Let's take a look at these troop buffs here because we do actually have them. Okay. That infantry attack, what is going on there? I love this. I love everything about this. Let's move on to number five. Holy shit. Number five on the list breaks the 200 million power loss already. So you can imagine what the top four look like. Okay. We have, and I don't, I cannot pronounce the names of these players. So we have the rally coming in from Alliance 74 NV hitting the pass that is being defended by JST. And again, we see Pakal Herald, Pakal Herald with 9.2 million deads, 8.7 million sev wounds and 112 million slightly wounded units. Actually, that's insane. That's actually insane. But the pass loses 204 million power with Zenobia YSS. We see 16.2 million dead units with 14.5 million sev wounds. I actually had somebody comment on my last video where I covered these battle reports saying, Hey, you sound really stupid comparing this to real world fights. So I guess we'll just compare it to something else. Uh, in the year 2020, 206 million iPhones were sold. So we see way more slightly wounded units involved in this war alone than there were all iPhones sold in the entire world last year what the f anyway moving on coming in at number four is the absolute mad lad abdul mg versus the pass held by eric and what do you know pakal herald pakal herald you lose 188 million power from the rally and 221.5 million from the pass with Zenobia YSS, baby. This is getting insane. Abdul's rally losing 13.6 million units with 12.8 million severely wounded, 151 million slightly wounded units coming from that rally alone. The pass over there suffering a bit heavier with 19.5 million dead troops, 18.3 million severely wounded units and 203 million slightly wounded. We broke the 200 million mark for a single side slightly wounded already in the video. Holy shit. Since we're going to be talking a lot about Pakal in this video, I feel like it's important that I tell you guys that the number of dead troops here in this rally alone is more than the total number of estimated Mayan civilians at the peak of their reign. So yeah, what the fuck? Coming in at number three is none other than Tanglin. I'm pretty sure we've seen this mad lad in one of these videos before, but this is an absolute savage player. And of course, there is no rally without your alliance. So the alliance BLN hitting a flag, hitting a flag owned by H593 what the hell is going on here pakal herald losing 193.2 million power with 28.2 million deads how is this even po like this has got to be one of the longest flag rallies right usually these videos we talk about past rallies maybe four rallies right but a flag holy shit. and this is only 2 million troops like there's not even kvk tech involved here what what even what what the flag defended by zenobia yss again we see 23.2 million dead troops with 6.8 million severely wounded so i don't know if this was like all t4 and this was all t5 because we see obviously the power loss is more substantial over there on the side of the flag course anyway the rally had 188 million slightly wounded with the 197 million slightly wounded for Zenobia YSS that's equivalent to the number of times that I've been called a farmer here on YouTube which is actually insane <laughs> man I wish I had these full reports because you know there's some insanity happening down here that we just cannot see coming in at number two and the report that I want to give the highest praise to in this video I know 
it's not number one and you'll see why in just a minute but number two the number two spot here is none other than ali j defending a pass against a rally from panda holy shit, guys what the heck okay so we see 265.9 million power loss on the pass side with zenobia we see 186.2 million power loss from you guessed it pakal herald points this rally you are sleeping on pakal herald this is insane so the pass suffered 18.6 million dead troops with 17.4 million sev wounds and 214 million slightly wounded units panda's rally over here with alliance sp28 has 12.8 million dead troops with 11.8 million severely wounded a beautiful trade here for those guys 153 million slightly wounded troops this just happened this was august 26th my god this is another one of those things where i wish i could see the aoe right because you know the aoe from isun sin just deals so much damage here's a fun little fact in 2020 3.3 million people died in the united states that means 10 times more troops died in this rally than everyone who died in the united states last year combined like these numbers are so big you can't even think about it like you, you just your brain cannot even comprehend how many deaths these are in terms of video game troops and guys the number one most insane war report in rise of kingdoms history is still none other than the phantom good father rally now we've shown this off in the previous video which is why i said the one before this was actually the one that I give the highest praise to because this one is nothing new. Uh, we just haven't seen anything bigger than this. At least I haven't, but I just couldn't make the video without including it because it is literally the biggest. Holy sh what the fuck? I can't wait. I cannot wait for this record to be broken. And I have a feeling that Ramsey's Gilgamesh is going to do it. it it's going to do it. It's going to be a Zenobia YSS and it's going to get absolutely destroyed. Anyway, guys, if you made it to the end of the video, drop a thumbs up on it. It really helps out the channel a ton and it helps get this video out into the YouTube algorithm. So the rise of King those players might see it if you're new around here subscribe to the channel and click that bell to be notified the next time that i upload a rise of kingdoms video comment down below for your chance to win a hundred dollars no strings attached and also another huge shout out to the brand new partner gamer subs the free samples are really only going to be for a limited time so make sure you take advantage of that and if you want the free shipping this is the perfect time to do it and if you do place an order make sure you send me a screenshot for a second chance to win a hundred dollars there's a link down below to download rise of kingdoms absolutely for free for your pc it's a program called blue stacks and it's my favorite way to play rise of kingdoms if you don't like it you can always uninstall it later but i would say give it a try why not finally my social media links they're always down below make sure you follow me on instagram twitter facebook Facebook, Discord, all that stuff, it's always down below. And with that being said, guys, thank you so much for watching. This has been Omniarch. I will talk to you guys again soon. Peace.